The Cinderella story of the South Bay has to be the boys from Evergreen Valley. From out of nowhere, EV has vaulted to the top of the West Valley Division standings and was looking for league win number 10 when they hosted Silver Creek. Out we go to the Cougars' den, brand new crib for Evergreen. The Raiders dominate the first half. Dante Spears making the pick at half court. Dante finishing with the layup. Now watch Silver Creek, Landon Summers dribbling through the zone. Defense scores with the kiss off the glass. The Raiders lead by six at the half. Evergreen Valley rallies in the third. It's Cody Coppernol at the high post to Mark Gamelos down low. That's two. Fourth quarter, the Cougars catch the Raiders. EV Steven Yasateki pulling up from 10. Evergreen Valley trails by one. The Cougars' Morgan Blakely had a great game. Blakely runs it up from the side, fires it up from the arc. Nothing but net. Evergreen Valley rallies from behind to beat Silver Creek by one. 40 to 39, the final score. More now on the Evergreen Valley boys hoop team as we join Brody Brazil. Yeah, Brody joins us live in a living room in San Jose thanks to Orchard Supply Hardware. What's up, Brody? Hey, Christine, how are you doing? It doesn't get any better than this. You just see their highlights, and now you get to meet the team, the guys from the Evergreen Valley boys basketball team. Yeah! You know, I'll tell you what, these guys won a game tonight, and they're not that excited. We're going to try that one more time at the end, okay? I want to see a little more excitement, maybe? All right? Yeah? Yeah, okay. Morgan Blakely. Now, Morgan, we, just, we were just talking a few minutes ago. 70% of your shots are three-pointers. How are you getting that wide open on the perimeter? <laughs> well, sometimes I'm not even open. I'll be like five feet back, but I'll take it anyway. Sometimes it falls, sometimes it doesn't. But I'm keep taking it. Yeah, well, you know, these guys said that your shots create a lot of offensive rebounds. Yeah. Well, uh, no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, but, but if you weren't making so many shots, you guys wouldn't be doing as, as well as you are. So. Yeah, I mean, three-pointers are a big mo momentum swinger, you know. Yeah. Two straight threes, six points up. That's right. It's very quick. That's a big swing, and you guys pull it off sometimes. Gurchet Sangera. That's not an easy name to say, i got to admit to you. But let me run some numbers by you. Okay, four sophomores, four juniors, zero seniors, and you, have, you guys have a record of 20 and four. How do you pull that off with such a young squad? Uh, we've been playing together since um, our first summer league, which was my eighth grade year, mm -hmm. and we just play together spring league, summer league. We just good team chemistry right there. So it's no problem. It's your yeah. advantage then, right? Yeah. Okay. Just. Uh, and to let all you other guys know that we're, we're going to come get you guys next year. So. Oh, he's calling him out on Sports Focus. All right, all right, Gurchet. Remember, his name is Gurchet Sangera. That's his face right there. And we're at Roman, the Hall's house now, Roman. Uh, your dad's out of town. You want to give him a quick uh, shout-out real quick? Yeah, what up, Dad? We're parting over here while you're gone. <laughs> dad's out of town, so his son invited the whole hoop squad over. But uh, we were just talking about team chemistry. Yeah, That's team a chemistry, definitely. I think almost all of us back since... Seventh grade, we're always playing with each other and on and off the court. We've just been, you know, nothing but basketball. We're always talking about basketball, and yeah. that's how it's been going pretty right. much. And none of this would be possible without Coach Fernandez. Get out of the way. Let's see Coach Fernandez. Coach. There he is. That's a real coach right there looking at him. I guarantee that just got Roman some more playing time. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. He doesn't anymore. Roman, we want to give your mom a $100 gift certificate to Orchard Supply Hardware. There you go. Miss Nahal, thank you very much. We appreciate it. And uh, guys, you want to do your little thing here? Go. What time is it? Game time. What time is it? Game time. Cougars on three. One, two, three. Cougars, yeah. Cougars on three. Chris and Mike, we're rolling back live to you guys. Thanks, Brody. Nice to see there's adult supervision there besides <laughs> Brody, right? The West Valley League title on the line as Silver Creek visits Evergreen Valley. The Cougars off to a fast start. Morgan Blakely pulling up for the three to give Evergreen the early lead. Next, it's Cody Coppernall getting physical in the paint. He'll go up strong for two, and it's 10-0 Cougars. Silver Creek with a rally. Aaron Atkinson throwing it up for three of his game-high 15 points. Atkinson again cutting through the key, pulling up with a finger roll for two, and Silver Creek takes the lead 24-18 at the break. Second half, Gurchit Sangera calls his own number and knocks down the three-pointer to put the Cougs back on top. Six seconds left, 40-39 Evergreen, Silver Creek with one last shot. It's blocked, and Evergreen holds on to win the game and the West Valley League title after the scramble. They cut down the nets. Evergreen Valley, 40 to 39, the winner. After the game, Wild 94.9's Drina Gonzalez talked with the Evergreen Cougars about their first ever league title. Drina Gonzalez here for Cal High Sports Bay Area. We are with the Evergreen Valley Cougars. What's up, guys? Yeah! yeah. 
Kerchet Singer, you guys just beat Silver Creek High, 40 to 39, real close game. Tell me how important was this uh, game for the team? Uh, this game was very important because to them, they consider us one of uh, a rival school, and by beating them, we just clinched league. All right, congratulations. Morgan Blakely, tell me, you guys are a young team, no seniors. You're also a new school. How did you feel that would affect you on the court this season? What did you guys do to overcome any fears? Uh, yeah, we didn't have any seniors, so we knew we needed to work hard over the summer. Lots of us were going to basketball camps and everything. And also, we've been playing together for a long time, so we have great team chemistry. So we knew we could hold our own. Always important on the court. Jeff Brass, okay, you get to play coach for just a couple seconds. <laughs> I want you to turn to your teams right now. This is the first CCS playoff games you guys are going to. Give them some words of encouragement as you guys head off to do big things. Yeah, you know, we're uh, setting a new tradition coming out for CCS, second year, so just come out and play strong. You know, do our thing. We can't forget the main coaches. Necklaces, beautiful. <laughs> Evergreen Valley Cougars, congratulations, guys. Yeah. I'm Drina Gonzalez. Back to you, Robert. Thanks, Drina, and congratulations to Coach Dennis Fernandez and the Evergreen Cougars.